You know the saying, if you can't beat them, join them? Well, that is absolutely true when it comes to AI. It's not going away. And if you've noticed, it's becoming more and more dominant in our lives. So I, I decided to embrace it, dive in, tackle it, and have been using it for over a year. And it has transformed my business because with the power of AI, specifically ChatGPT, it writes almost all my content. Almost, because I never copy and paste from ChatGPT. I'm gonna show you how, but I actually use it to do all my content planning from YouTube episodes to podcast editions, real content, captions, hashtags. And with a new uh, new feature they have, you can actually have it do research for you to give you trending audio, hashtags, all the things at your fingertips. So let's dive in. I'm gonna actually screen share and show you. And now you can be able to see the power of what this can do for you. Let's take a look inside of ChatGPT. Now, at the time of this recording, there is a, I think it's like a beta version called 4.0. Oh, and at first it was free and I exceeded the maximum usage. So I upgraded it's like 20 bucks a month. It's totally worth it because with the 3.5 version, you can't access the internet from, to my knowledge with this one, you can. So often I'll ask it to do research, research for me to find the best courses on a certain topic and just to take all of that data and come up with a new version of it based on my, my audience and my avatar. So I wanted, I pulled this up. This is old, but I, wanted to show it to you because it's the greatest example to show you what you can do with this. So the first thing I want to show you is how you can use ChatGPT to write, and I actually love the app, by the way, I use it all the time for captions, for reels, is to plan out an entire content calendar. So if you struggle with, like, I don't even know what to do, what to be doing every day, you can prompt it. And we actually have a couple of resources for you below. And I'm going to gift this one to you. I, I normally charge for it. Unlock the power of Chat ChatGPT Mastery. This one, um, if you want to buy it and resell it, you can do that. So just check out. But otherwise, if you use the promo code chat, then it'll be free. So I'll put that below for you. And in it, it has all the prompts that I'm showing you. The key with ChatGPT is how to prompt it. You have to know how to ask it for what you want. Otherwise, it won't work. Okay. So the first thing, here's a content um, calendar for the entire month of October tailored to TikTok profile that aims to help moms with weight loss, healthy eating, and boosting energy. So I asked it to write me a content calendar. It gave me a whole month's worth with the theme, the content idea, and any notes. So this would be very, very vague, right? It, you wouldn't know like, okay, if you're doing TikTok, we all know that's going to be video-based, but maybe you want something specific. Maybe you want it to tell you the hook to use on the TikTok, the caption, the hashtags, that kind of thing. Okay. So we'll talk more about that. So Let's see. Um, then I actually asked it to be, uh, to write some Facebook captions for it for that, um, that correspond to each day of the TikTok calendar. So then I could have my Facebook content stemming from the TikTok account. So this is a way to repurpose content and being able to take one idea and use it on many platforms. So it went ahead and it wrote out posts for it. Every single time I do this, I tell it, remove the emojis, remove the emojis, remove the emojis. These, all these emojis, you guys are a telltale sign that you're using ChatGPT. So just get rid of them. I have a couple that I always use. That's like what I'm known for, like fire. And I wouldn't use any of these other ones. Okay. So that's the first thing I wanted to show you. You can ask it to plan out your content for you. The second thing I want to show you is how you can use ChatGPT to actually come up with good real captions, hashtags, because this is such a huge part of our content creation process, obviously. So again, uh, this version is, it's showing you it search six sites right here. So it's looking online for you. It's gonna give you timely information, which is fabulous. So this was actually for a coaching client. We were on a group call and I just demoed this. So I call my chat GPT Ginger. So I was having a new Instagram account. This is the topics we're gonna cover. So I wrote those out. I told uh, Chat ChatGPT my avatar. And then can you take this info and create a 30-day content plan for me? Please look at, look, this is key. Tell it to go look and do research, research, research for you. Please look at blog posts or other websites that have useful tips I can incorporate. And then this is my favorite part. I want you to include the piece of content, the caption and trending hashtags under 500,000 uses each. With hashtags, you wanna make sure that they're, they're under 500,000 for sure. I would even go closer to like under 250,000 because you don't want them to be overused. You still want to be able to, to populate in the, the search results. So it searched six sites. If you want to see which sites it went to, you can click on those. And then here's a 30 day content plan uh, for your new Instagram account. So week one, cultivating confidence. Here's the post, the content, 
it's telling you what to do. So a personal photo with an introduction about who you are, what your account will focus on. Here's the caption. And then I always tell it to rewrite the captions to engage people and by asking a question, pulling my pulling my audience into the content because it tends to just give facts or just kind of like rah, rah. Also, I tell it to remove the emojis like I told you. So here are a bunch of uh, examples of that. Then the next thing I did is, can you rewrite the captions for the first week, giving three to five tips for each and asking the audience a question to create engagement? That is gold right there. What I just gave you is a killer prompt because now I'm getting it to give me a caption with tips. You want to make sure you're giving real nuggets in your content and then asking a question and then some hashtags. Okay. And then I wanted to show that to you. And then the other thing you can do is can you write a caption for a reel with five examples of good CTAs for those creating content? So here is examples of good CTAs. Look how detailed these are, but they're giving you examples of good calls to action to get people engaged. And then look at this, this is so fun. Can I have 10 hashtags about money mindset and money manifestation, law of attraction, all under 500,000 uses? And look, it tells me the hashtags, it tells me how many uses. And then I say, just list them out, here they are. Then I say no numbers, just the hashtags. And now I can copy this and put this. I have an actual content calendar I use. I'll have to do a training on that because it's I, I created it myself. It's the best thing ever. It's on Google Sheets, but it literally is going to change your life. So stay tuned. I'll have to do a video on that. But I call them hashtag sets. So I take this, copy it, paste it on a column, uh, and it, I just put money mindset. So I know just the general t- uh, vibe of that entire hashtag set. Hey, hey, Kimberly Olson here. I wanted to interrupt this really quickly to tell you something coming up that's super important and awesome and you want to be a part of it. It's my multiple streams to multi-millions workshop. I'm going to teach you how I've built up to almost 30 streams of income. Almost all of them are online and being able to tap into this intel. I'm going to give you a workbook for the workshop. I'm going to give you my guide, the ultimate guide to nailing your niche on social media and the Lazy Girl's Guide to Making Bank, which has my favorite 50 ways to make money on social media. Like this is jam packed. So click the link below to register and I will see you there. This next one's really fun. I do a lot of course creation. I have over 130 courses I've created. So we have something called The Vault. It's our membership program. And I was creating a new course for it, but I decided to open it up to everybody so you can actually grab it. It's called the YouTube Starter Kit. It's literally, we we actually did a live call with it that's included. You can, you can watch, uh, watch it to nail down your niche. And the next day I had all these DMs of people who had launched their YouTube channels. It was really cool. So if you want it, uh, grab it. It's totally worth it. So when I was developing the course, I asked chat GPT to search the most popular YouTube courses for business online and put together a course outline. So it searched five sites, which is really neat. I could go and look at those if I wanted to. And then it gave me an outline. I asked it to give me an outline. And it gave me the module names, what to cover. And this is actually what I worked off of. So I changed it. I, you know, I'm not going to sit here and be, be a robot working with a robot, but I was able to have enough here to run with and go ahead and create that course. So I recorded the whole thing, start to finish, recorded it and was able to release it. And it did really well. Um, people loved it, like I said, but how much time would I have wasted? thinking about, I don't know what to do for my course. I mean, there's probably a course you want to create that you've been thinking about for way too long. So ChatGPT can absolutely help you out with that. And then the final thing I want to show you is YouTube topics. So this was also for a client. I want to come up with 12 ideas for YouTube episodes around these topics. Uh, Avatars over 40, boost energy and sleep, reclaim your health, age better, live life on your terms. Because you've got to give it some intel to to be able to act, you know, generate a good response. So here we go. We've got 12 YouTube episodes of boosting energy and sleeping better with the tips, reclaiming your health. So what I do is when I go to record now, I just like this one, I don't have an outline. I have the things I wanted to show you, but I don't, I didn't ask chat TV to write an outline for this. And when you're new though, it can be really helpful. Or if it's a topic where you want to offer value, but you, you don't really feel like you have enough to offer, this can give you more ideas. So what I would do is if you feel like this is enough, you can absolutely just work off of this. Otherwise you could say, okay, now for Reclaim Your Health, that episode, I want you to write me a full outline that I can use to record my YouTube episode. And it's gonna write a full outline for you. You can also do this with podcasts, Facebook Lives. You can do this for blog posts. 
you could even take some of these ideas it's generated and say, okay, now write a blog post. So you've got your YouTube episode, you can embed it into your blog post, drop a pin on Pinterest because our number one source of website traffic is Pinterest. And look at what you've just created with just a few different assets. It's just mind blowing how much content you can create easily. What I find with content creation is people get mental fatigue. You know what I'm talking about. They get that mental fatigue and they're just like, oh, I'm just so over it. This removes that mental fatigue. This is going to allow you to be able to have it do a lot of the thinking for you. And then you can put your finesse on it, customize it and truly make it your own. How much do you love ChatGPT now that I showed you that? Seriously, my mind is blown. Every time I go on there, I learn something new. It's just changing my life. So I want to encourage you to start using it right away. Also, I have a couple of videos that will pop up at the end here that I'll recommend based on you wanting to learn about ChatGPT, specifically batch preparing your content, planning out your content, really just getting you very organized when it comes to your content strategy. And I also have a special gift for you below. It's my number one international bestseller, Boss It Up Babe. You just pay for shipping and I'll actually send over a copy to you and some extra goodies as well. So you can really learn how to monetize your brand on social media. If this was helpful, my name is Kimberly Olson, also known as the Gold Digger Girl. Click that button to subscribe, take a screenshot, throw it in your stories and tag me at the Gold Digger Girl. I'd love to give you a shout out for doing that. Until next time, get lit in your business and set your soul on fire. Bye.